Hi, welcome back to a new video. In a previous video, I had shown you how you can remove spikes from these signals. So in this video, we are going to take a new case. Suppose that this signal has a 60 Hz hum noise. That means, a hum noise means unwanted noise and you want to perform a band stop filter to remove that noise. In many cases, you might have noticed that when you are reading a DC signal of your battery or of your circuit, then you might get there a high frequency noise of a 50 Hz or a 60 Hz. It depends on in which country you are working. So if you get this 50 or the 60 Hz noise, then what you can do? You can apply there a band stop filter of 50 Hz or a 60 Hz to remove that hum from your signal. Suppose that if we consider this signal as a hum, then we our signal must follow this path. Right? So our signal must follow this path and this much of amplitude is just a 60 Hz power noise. So in this video, I am going to show you how you can remove the 60 Hz power noise and you can follow it like a just a like a just a data fitting and the curve fitting signal. That means our goal is to implement here band stop filter. Right? So here we are going to implement a band stop filter. Band stop filter with 59 to 61 hertz band stop right so we are going to use a signal processing toolbox which have design field function the design field function takes first parameter as a response type and the response type is band stop IIR filter so it is a band stop IIR filter and the second filter and the order of filter is second order and half frequency that is half power frequency This is half power frequency. So first half power frequency that is minus 3 dB frequency is 59 and similarly half power frequency to is 61. and filter design method which we are going to implement here that is Butterworth filter sorry this is this is Butterworth so that's the butter and the sample rate which we have already declared there FS that is 1000 so this is band stop IIR filter with a filter order 2 which have first cutoff frequency is 59, second half hour cutoff frequency is 61 and we are going to implement here Butterworth filter that is maximally flat Butterworth filter with a sampling rate of 1000. Now it will create a filter coefficients, a filter structure into a D and after that I can show you this with the filter visualization tool magnitude and the phase response so you need to type here FB tool that is filter visualization tool with FS now you will see here its frequency response along with the magnitude I mean the magnitude response along with the frequency response 
right here now you can see here it has a band stop a band stop depth at 60 exactly and the half power is at 59 and at the 61 so this is half power cutoff frequency and if you see here a phase response of this filter is like this and from here you can see its phase and magnitude response together perfect now we are going to apply filtering here IIR filtering to remove this 60 Hertz hum from this signal so it's really very simple you can just write here why of course y is uh, you know the our signal if you see here plot y shg so this is y is our signal so we can say result is equal to filt filt so if you remember in previous lectures we have used filt filt for zero phase filtering so zero phase filtering means it will not produce any delay while filtering now let's plot this result along with the t perfect it's amazing now if I show you this figure into a new figure sorry the plot of t and y then you will be amazed to see the result see here right now if you can see that this signal we have considered as a hum noise that's mean a power noise in your signal and we have applied here digital band stop filter to remove this power noise or hum noise from your signal So far in this tutorial, we have learned how we can apply a band stop filter to remove a particular type of noise. If you have a frequency content of some type of noise, then you can obviously apply their band stop filter. Otherwise, band pass, FIR low pass, IIR low pass or high pass filters are preferable. So this is all about in this video. Thank you so much for watching this one. Please do not forget to subscribe this channel so that you can get updates directly into your inbox. Bye bye. Have a nice day.